in the Framingham Heart Study. I've quoted this study a couple of times, 30,000 people, little town over many years. They found that by the age of 50, 40 percent of, or most people had lost 40 percent of their lung capacity. Why is that? Because people never do what you experience when you get to the end of your 30 seconds. Those lungs are just stretched wide open. Those little bronchioles right at the end are being forced to, to start working. High chest breathers can find that the bottom half of their lungs can almost go into dormancy. So no wonder by the age of 50, many have lost 40% of their lung capacity. The, the study showed that by the age of 80, most had lost 60% of their lung capacity. Remember oxygen, the most vital element needed for life? Well, and that's where we get it, through our lungs. Recovery. Your recovery time is the, your indicator of your fitness. Dr. Al Sears, in his book, Pace, he's considered the exercise doctor. His book is a bestseller. What does pace mean? P is progressive. This is progressive. The more you do it, the stronger you will get. I don't, I don't know whether this has ever got easy. <laughs> it's certainly easier than when I first started. But it's the recovery time shortens. So your recovery time is your fitness indicator. So pace is, P is progressive. A is acceleration. You are accelerating. This is no gentle stroll. You're accelerating. So when Michael and I are running up the hill, we don't talk then. He's way ahead of me because his legs are about four inches longer than mine. I say to him, you must love running with me. It makes you feel like an Olympic runner. <laughs> so you are accelerating. And C is cardiopulmonary. So cardia meaning the heart muscle. There's one way to strengthen the heart. There's no other way, and that is exercise. 